It's Heather. It's Isla. And we are going to do a singing game today for second graders. And in our singing game, which is a unit lesson plan, we've done two prepping lesson plans that get us ready for our singing game. We practice our movement and our body percussions with our partners, and we practice learning some information about what we're singing about. So who can tell me what type of animal is a kookaburra? A kingfisher bird. High five. And what country does a kingfisher kookaburra bird come from? Uh, Australia. Australia. And we learned Australia is a very unique country because it has its own continent. Mm -hmm. And we in the United States of America live on a continent, but we share our continent with two other countries. To the north, our neighbors are... Canada. Yes. And to the south, our neighbors are... Mexico. And those three countries make up the North American continent. But Australia is its own continent and its own country, very unique. And is it similar to the United States of America? Or what is different about the continent of Australia? It's an island. Yes, with a kingfisher bird on it. And when the kookaburra sings, the kookaburra sounds very unique compared to other birds, especially any of the birds from North America. So what does the call of the kookaburra sound like? It sounds like it's laughing. It does. Let's listen. Let's hear the call of the kookaburra. <laughs> He's awesome. I would like to have a friend who laughs like that. So yesterday we practiced our song and we sang along to the lyrics and we decided who would be our partner for the singing game and we added some movement and body percussion and we are going to do that today as well. But we're going to practice and we're going to listen to just the first chorus of the song and everybody sing along with the first chorus and then we will sing together as a class. <laughs> Kookaburra sits in the old gum tree. The merry king of the bush is he. Sing, kookaburra sing, kookaburra sing your song for me. Okay, so we remember the rhythm and the lyrics. So everybody get with your partner, okay? And we are going to sing and move with our song. Are you ready? Yes. Okay, I'm ready too. Thanks for being my part. Ready? You leave. Kookaburra sits in the old gum tree. Merry, merry king of the bush is he. Sing, kookaburra, sing, kookaburra. Sing your song for me. Kookaburra sits in the old gum tree. Eating all the gumdrops he can see. No, kookaburra, no, kookaburra, save some there for me. Kookaburra sits in the old gum tree, watching all the monkeys he can see. Wait, kookaburra, wait, kookaburra, they look funny to me. Kookaburra sits in the old gum tree. Very, very king of the bush is he. Sing, Kookaburra, sing, Kookaburra. Sing your song for me. Awesome. That was really cool. So from the song, what did we learn about a kookaburra? What kind of tree does a kookaburra sit in? A gum a gum, a gum tree, a gum tree, which are very po very populated throughout Australia. And does he eat a lot of bubblegum in the gum song? Drops. Gum drops. And what type of animal does he see? A monkey. Okay, cool. Now, if you got to change the movement to the very first part of the chorus, the kookaburra sits in an old gum tree. Merry, merry king of the bush is he. Sing kookaburra, sing kookaburra, sing your song for me. You be the leader, and I'll do whatever movements you do and any body percussion you do. You okay. can change it this time. Okay. Ready? Whatever you want to do. Okay. Um, Kookaburra sits in the old 
come tree. Merry, merry king of the bushes, he. Sing, kookaburra, sing, kookaburra, sing your song for me. Yay! And so if we were in class, we would have a circle and we would work with our partners and we would let different leaders come in the middle of the circle and change the movements that we do to the song. And we could work on it and on the next time we sang the song, we could change some of the lyrics. And instead of gumdrops, we could use pizza or bubblegum. And instead of monkeys, what other animals could we see? Cats. Um... And what's really popular in Australia? That hops a lot. A kangaroo. Yeah, that'd be cool. Okay, thanks so much for watching our singing game. Bye. Peace.